Hitting the net at the West Coast Sevens in San Diego, a tournament now in its sixth year with a brand new venue in the Olympic Training Center. But watch out for the rattlesnakes and teams from far and wide. It's amazing. I know they just transferred pitches, so we got the new pitch this year for the tournament, but it's absolutely unreal. The weather's been so good. And just to see all the clubs, too, come together for this. Did you think the standard of play would be as high as it is? Uh, you know, it's hard because it's like it's in May, so the teams are just coming out. But the effort that we've put in and the effort I've seen on the other pitches, like it's just so cool. And it is fast paced, but that's the way to get into another way. Definitely the way to start summer. Local club San Diego Nafiana fielded three teams and were delighted to win a trophy. For sure, it was like we all trained together, so it was like a training match. But at the end of the day, we come out here, we split our, split our team into three teams, like for, and we're a junior B level. To come out here and be able to contest three teams at junior B is, you know, and come out with the win is great. Like you know, it's it's incredible. And playing here in this new venue for the West Coast Sevens, what do you think of it? Absolutely, it's magnificent. Like there's definitely no better place I'd rather be. You know, I'm dreading going back to training. <laughs> you know. Yeah, because the last few years, I mean, this is a step up in terms of venue. What do you think it'll do for the tournament? Oh, I think it's going to grow it massively. Like, like, there's no doubt. When people get footage of this tournament, like, it's going to grow. It's going to grow huge. Danielle Downey, all the way from Cork, all the way from McCroom out here in beautiful San Diego. How nice is it to be here and to win a trophy? Oh, yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Uh, it's class. Like, the, the grass is unreal, and it, it's, it's really nice to play on. Um, yeah, the, the facility and you know the way they organised everything around the place is is really good this year. Recruitment and encouragement are always key, which is why one player from Orange County was selected on a North American team to play Ireland. I was meeting with my friend's boyfriend and I got recruited by Michelle on the Wild Geese and I've been playing ever since. I'd never even heard of it as a game before. And I just showed up to practice one day and I've been kind of hooked on it. It's really, really fun. And how long ago was that and how quickly have you become an international player? <laughs> I've been playing for probably two months. <laughs> yeah. And are you going to stick at it? What was that? Are you going to stick at it? Sorry, that's an Irish term. Are you going to keep playing? <laughs> yes, I do plan to keep playing. Whose idea was it? you know, to come to San Diego and what was, you know, what did you like about the idea of this place apart from that it's America's finest city? Yeah, well, we had a short home base and myself and Elaine Murphy were like, we need, to, this is such a great opportunity, we have to take advantage of it. So we just asked all the girls and there wasn't a hesitation and we just booked it and we're here. And now you're here, what do you think of the whole setup, the way that it's organized? Oh, it's so cool and you have two days to put the time in and hopefully win and go on and if not, I mean, you just had a great day out playing football with all your friends and all the new friends that you do make. So how are the folks at Harps going this year? Yeah, we're going good. Um, we've recruited a good good few girls. Um, so, yeah, hoping to do the business in North Americans this year. Yeah. The bigger picture is that Nafina haven't been winning trophies for a number of years and you've come from literally nowhere now to have three teams which is crazy it, it's brilliant like you know we like this tournament has been a turn on my side every year just trying to get a winning team out there and it's tough because you're spl splitting your junior b team into three teams you know to go out against one one team uh, that has their full, full junior b team out there so to come out with a cup is just it's great you know and it's really it's going to help us build our team you know like it, we're up and coming and you know can't wait for nationals so it's not all about winning but it's nice it's not all about winning for sure but we set out this year the girls you know and we said you know what this is our year we need to do this you know and we're out there to win it and we train so hard you know we train two three times a week you know and we're out there to win it this year for any tournament not just on our own turf it is sweeter on your home turf but the rest of the tournaments too <laughs>